to see that pickup list too. Yeah. That's what squad for O two hundred EOTs, squad one seven seven. All right, we're back. Sorry about that. One seven nine. One seven nine. One eighty. One eighty. One eight five. Got a little overheating. Our, our camera overheated. We're trying to analyze. We're doing contract tracing to see who gave him the COVID. Oh. <laughs> Got a fever. The camera had a fever. Couple possibilities. We took the cover off. Took the charger off. It's got a 80. It got 100 percent charge, and I think even more likely we had the heat coming out of the dash. Bravo 156. I think that contributed to the overheating. Have any additional? We never had that problem before. Then 4490. Yeah, that was the first. 4438 to assist at 2441 Maplewood Drive North, the Northern Air Motel, and unit 117. We've got a caller on the phone that said she received a text from a party by the name of Heather Lindman, who is supposed to be at the Northern Air. She said that she's going to take a bottle of pills and hang herself. Party Heather uh, is a 30-year-old female, white, 5'2", uh, thin, sandy blonde hair. You're not going to fit through there, are we, Pat? Drake, mm -mm. I well, that was kind of a Order. William X ray 6553. Copy Long Lake Road 694 at 145. Can I not meet you that? Suicide. We'll show you en route. We'll keep all squads around 145. And actually, Eric, thank you for the advice. That is actually exactly what we did do to get the phone cooled down fast, was we held it out the window. Oh, yeah. I was going to pour some cold Mountain Dew on it, but... <laughs> cars on the road to be endangered in some type of pursuit. Good point. I wonder why we didn't know about that stolen the trooper. 1396. The stolen the trooper was there. Yeah, Can you take a harassment report? 1397 Street Northwest, Unit 17. Suspect's not on scene. Thank you, 146. Well, I had my radio off. I guess there was shots fired on Bradley. 44, 67. 6 to at Northern Air, 147. So what are we on here? This one's on two. You're on three? I'm on three. Well, this is one now. I'll put this one on two. Well, with that pickup truck that, truck that was leaving that shots four, four, fired, you, you have to weigh your concerns. We wanted to see if there was somebody shot in need of medical attention. There could have been a lot of them shot. Yeah, that was a <laughs> lot of gunshots. Yeah. 314. 314. Key changes to a DLC. Market vibes with 301 and 315. Mm -hmm. The confusing part, of course, of where the sound is coming from, but most of the shots fired up there on those side streets of Wyzetta, Manitoba, and Winnipeg. You know, the drug deals that are dealing with down there. So. Okay, and that was not shots fired on Bradley. It was uh, 
A family member pounding on the door too hard. Twenty twelve. We're close to that DLC. Cancel that. Triple two two three three clear. Two two three copy. Thank you. Triple two copy clear. Thanks. One forty nine. Three one four copy. The suspicious. Routes in the area of Magnolia and Arkray and Jesse Mine and Jesse at 149. I think that's uh, the same name as a place from the state fair. Maybe they opened up a brick and mortar spot. Checking your status on traffic. Controlled on field to the squad to start till code 4. Are you on air 7 and with him? With 8197 at 151. Ninety-one seventy. Ninety-one seventy. Can you put me out at Wafer Avenue and South Shore? Uh, with two on foot and code four. With two parties, Wafer South Shore one fifty-two. Start towards the domestic trouble three simply street number six one six car advising that her husband assaulted her. Still getting further. Two to twelve. I'm gonna run up the speedway and north on Rice Street there. Come to the close, wife. Sounds like a good idea. Won't just rings. 
we still got some Copy that. hot dogs We're out, out. there. See, the one thing about this uh, live stream is there are a couple differences because we don't we don't want to get out and go to a restaurant or some place to eat for any length of time because we know that would be boring and uh, cops are generally pretty good at eating. Would you say? Yes. And you know. So a pizza place or our side or some place like that. We might normally go to. We gotta check on the tin cup. Make sure everything's looking good here. to call it a night up here. Fifty one eighty two, clear unfounded. One fifty four. But when we're on this live feed, we tend to just grab something we can hold in our hand. Yeah. The meal party has a white Camry there on 4th Street. We're attempting to get a direction of travel. We're driving at a high rate of speed. Copy. It looks like they're going to be on Warner Road. Still don't have a direction. How you doing? Good. Time to close up, huh? Forty-four sixty-two. Do you want us to have Maddox come in or keep staging? What is the deal? Okay. Yeah. So. Okay. Forty-four thirty-one. That didn't make, make any sense, does it? Right? No. He walks into the bar, and she walks away. Copy. We'll have him uh, meet you guys at the south side of the parking lot at 156. Oh, she's going in the side door. Ah, uh, okay. No, I don't know. I don't know, Gidget. If you're watching this, I'm not sure whose car that is, but the mail party just got out of that. Where is my Chevy 420. Yeah, we'll Maple Squad to assist at 3085 White Bear Avenue North. The Buffalo Wild Wings, our caller, is staff there reporting that there's a DK female party sitting inside of her white Jeep with the lights on. Uniform kilo, there Mike. A half hour. There's a party in the passenger seat, a black male. <coughs> the vehicle, a white Jeep, Minnesota Romeo Delta Juliet 982. Anyhow, I'm not sure if they're employees or what, but they definitely have keys to get in. With 38 at 157. Oh, that lady texted me. They tried to use the BP in... in the vehicle's uh, going to be going west on 94. Brooklyn, Brooklyn 61 Park. towards west on 94. It's good to know. Copy, I'm on, I'm on order right now. I'm heading towards 61. Copy. Just make sure that's the same number that I call. Seven. One eighteen. Yeah. Okay. information to squads the suspects in the robbery at Luella they tried to use the victims uh
credit card at the BP in Brooklyn Center. So after they used tried after they did use it at the BP here in Falcon Heights. Copy, just like in the robbery as well. Are you convicted to credit card at the BP in Brooklyn Center? Previously we used it at the BP in Falcon Heights. Information will be in. So Moving west. You know what we should do though? We should just go sit on the fucking. Sit on the freeway. We gotta go deliver the homeless. Let's get our hot dogs, go deliver the homeless stuff. Yeah, good idea. So, that lady that we called earlier to find out about her credit cards. They did notify her that someone tried to use it again in Brooklyn Park. I don't know if, uh, I don't know, I wonder if that one's open. 7130, clear report. 159. Credit for having two cars though. It was a one dollar authorization, which means it was for gas. Mm -hmm. But if they already used it successfully at the one in Falcon Heights, yeah, we would need to fill up again then that fast, right? Gas and up two cars. Go ahead. Surviving state is requesting an ETA. They're out at 535 Sherbert, and that's associated with the call you had earlier. Yeah, I'm guessing so. They're right at Sherbert and uh, almost to the other. ETA for what? Apparently, they're looking for St. Paul to still respond there. Copy. I think they were looking for someone from the shots fired to swing over and see if that vehicle is associated or not. They were talking to a county deputy when I left. Copy, thank you. Well, what's the vehicle they got there? They must have had two cars. Stolen? I wonder if they got the pickup truck. Well, they didn't tell us. I don't know if I'm going to closer to third of Mariah. I'm going to be located in the alley beach near that intersection. Copy. Oh. Ah, it's going quick, huh? Yeah. We'll be right back. We're going to go grab some nourishment so we can... Keep our energy level up to go look for those stolens. Won't be long. 2164. Got a mask fit. Yeah, how are you? 2164. Fiat 210 North Owasa Boulevard for a missing person report for a resident who eloped. Name is Keely Swanson, about 48 years old, Asian female, unknown clothing. Time delay is five to six minutes. Copy. Thank you, Toto. Is it the right place? 
Well, we are timing our stops at trying to get something to eat really bad. This is... Uh, 200. We're temporarily closed at this one for, I don't know, inventory or cleaning or something. Shots fired, calling Manitoba and Rice. I'm going to be at 535 Sherpa, and I'm looking for a squad to come out and help process. Sorry, there's some background noise. They're looking for a squad to do what? To process the vehicle with regards to that shots fired, that Manitoba and Rice. Manitoba and Rice. Sounds like they're getting a gun out of it or what? Sounds, Sounds like it. Is it the black pickup? 535 Sherpa. Okay to ask him. Yeah, I think Suki's there. Hang on a minute. Let me hold on. Let me just call Suki. 204. Two more copies. Pull back on there, too. Copy at 204. Uh, I gotta apologize. I haven't eaten. I'm still using too many Effenheimers. Sorry. <laughs> Are you down there with the car? Conway, Mariah. Well, did they find it? Did they find a gun down there or not? No. No, they didn't. Well, when I was there, I, the says, I, I was there. I didn't have my lights off. I have a driver's license because you can't search my car. And then they were waiting for a St. Paul guy to come down there. That's the last I heard of it. Sounds like maybe they did come down there and s somebody searched it. Is it the well, black? There was a St. Paul sergeant there when I was there. Before I left. So I don't know what happened after that. Well, I yeah, it was so confusing about which plate was with which car for me. Yeah. All right, well, I'm gonna call somebody down there and see what's going on. Thanks, thanks a lot. Hey, are you anywhere near there? Or have you left? Mark, are you anywhere near there? Or have you left? I, I left. I'm at Rice and Edger or Roseland and Edgerton. All right, I'm gonna call Alex see if I can get down there. Thank you. Is it? Thank you. Okay. Is it the black pickup we put out from I, the... I believe so, but oh. that's there. That's different than the... He had right, two yeah, cars. yeah. Alex doesn't know for sure, but he thinks it is. Suki's not there, so can you go back, go over there and... Yeah, we got we got the plate. Yeah. So we'll here just hang out. I'll look at it. E H F O nine six. It was Echo Hotel Foxtrot zero nine six. All right, let me. I'll run over there and I'll give you a call back in two seconds here and tell you. Thanks. Bye. I, yeah. think, I think they've got reason to myself. Oh, there's no doubt. I think they already got it. He thinks they already went in there. But um, well, we just don't have a victim or any casings. But if they got a gun, that's good <laughs> enough. I don't, we don't. I don't even know if it's the same truck. I'm assuming it is, right? Mm-hmm. This is the problem with communication. The state patrol's on a completely different system than we are. We can monitor them, but... We'll run down there. Yeah. I apologize for... I did pretty good so far this year. I only think I swore once or twice. <laughs> I think we both... Uh... I apologize. The good news is you're not getting any cropped out version of police work. <laughs> you're raw and unfiltered at raw times. And unfiltered. of the car at this point. Well, the health of them, the information was also sent to your screens at 208. 
Well, did they search it or not? Well, just come on, do some police work. Is there another trooper there or what? It must be. But I mean, is there? Is there? Yeah, go figure. We'll head down there and figure out. But, we know what vehicle it's yet the yet. right car it's the right plate but i don't know that they've searched it yet okay the pickup that we saw leaving yes okay but he said there's several troopers on several different stops <laughs> yes sir We'll be there soon. We'll be there soon. But. All right, so that car we saw leaving without its lights on at a high rate of speed is down there at Sherburn and yeah, McCubbin. The driver does not Water want to consent to search. Um, this is where the law gets very interesting. Because we saw him leaving at a high rate of speed from a sh shots fired area. Lights off. Lights off. Driving without his lights. So, what makes it even more interesting is Alex thinks there's three bullet holes in his door. <laughs> so, he's looking, he's looking at him. I asked him how, how recent. We also have a... There was a, an independent witness who said it was a black truck that fired the shots <laughs> from that parking lot. Last one, go again, your radio cut on. It's very close. Well, there's likely a gun in there. Last one, go again. I just can't let the gun walk away anyhow. Yeah. Yeah. I copy that was 2910, but I can't. No. Nope. Affirmative, go ahead. Just wondering if there's any squads available that can roll through Jimmy's parking lot. There's a crowd of people doing burnouts in the lot. Copy 2163. Crowd of people doing burnouts in Jimmy's lot. 2163, <laughs> That should be happening. Thank you, 211. Put 2361 into a left. 2164 last four are 1015. Again, 1015. You're welcome, 212. 5182. 5182. Your siren out there? In the no. apartment parking lot, 1700 block of Rice, I'm oh, sorry, Marion Street. The two vehicles covered license plates, both occupied. Stolen cars out there, man. 166. 166. Uh, vehicle possibly involved in that robbery earlier. Down on Ford. Took off north on Fairview. Can I confirm the plate? Uh, can you show me? Do you want to pursue? What robbery on four? Happy Park, everyone. Park Lane, 
must have been fair much. Traffic light speeds about 90. Vehicle going through lights. What's the description? It's a silver sedan, that's all I got. It's moving by me going 70 on Ford. Trying to catch up. Were you thinking the Fairmont robbery? Possibly. Vehicle last seen going west. Oh, that was an SUV. On uh, Fairview? Robert, what was he talking about? SUV or something? Copy, acting west on a Fairview. Oh, Right over there. Correction, it's going to be west on uh, Randolph. And I did cancel. Copy, west on Randolph, not pursuing. Was there a plate or anything on that? What property was that in relation to? Gentlemen? Negative, I didn't catch a plate. I was turning around at uh, the Ford Bridge. And it flew by me. And then I activated my lights and then it sped up east on Ford. And up north on Fairview. And West on Randolph. I saw it was a possible silver sedan or a light color sedan. Might have been that Lexus one earlier, but I'm not sure. Dispatch canceling the turn one at 2.15. One two six to one six six Kyoto Four. Squad ninety one seventy three. Vehicle theft report uh, 3521 Century Avenue North Unit 101. Copy. Four, four, sorry. 
Yeah, it was clear. Last clip, okay? Four four so many of the vehicles unoccupied. Unoccupied on Kenwood at two eighteen. Four four six nine. Do you also add Delta Henry Charlie six seven five to the call? Squads one eighteen and one eleven. Okay. With 101 to copy, 1631 Selby Avenue, apartment 6 for a weapons complaint. The caller's husband has a loaded gun in his hand. We're waiting for more information. Okay. 219. Copy that call as well. One twenty authorization for less lethal. Twenty one six three crowd is when you authorize less lethal. Boss, I can authorize. What do I want to One, two, six. I see the uh, comp hung up and didn't provide a description. Squad 98, 13. Checking your stuff. Affirm. Comp refused to give information and hung up on the TC. She did say that the husband walked out the back door of the address. I put a PCN in the call notes. We'll do a sub under that PCN. We'll be clear. 288, 215, 200. Copy. Do we have a description of this mail? Negative. The comp hung up before we were able to get one. One eighteen squad's pulling up. Two twenty one. Well, it's a phone bill that we know on the right. 2164, copy out with a female on right, said 221. 2164, Mother. Information for squads. We did get an update. The suspect is possibly in the back hallway. Comp keeps hanging up on the TC. Quite a break, Sinclair and Syndicate with 101 to copy for a hit and run accident with injuries. It's a vehicle versus a pedestrian. 126, I'll break. Let's squat it back. 2164. 129, I'll break. Should that copy? 174, I'll head there too. Two twenty two. Do we have a suspect vehicle description? Negative. Our first caller just had an open line. Could hear screaming. Two or three people were yelling. And then reported a vehicle versus pedestrian, but stand by, we'll try to get one. Thank you, 
one hit team break us as well. We'll go with the hit and run. Hold on, can we try one more callback and figure out if we can use a description or if there was a crime committed? Honey. Information for squads on the hit and run. Suspect vehicle description is a red SUV. No further description. Any interaction? Just got an update. Southbound on Syndicate. And now a new update is stating northbound syndicate. One two nine coming in the area. Two twenty four. Bravo one five two. Six three, you can clear me assist. Two twenty four. One two nine squads are arriving. We're not seeing anything. We get more information where this happened at. There's nobody out here. Copy. We have a new caller that stated they just saw an officer drive past the red SUV. I'll double check on location. Copy that. If we could find out where our victim is, it'd be nice. One two nine. Go ahead. The TC is stating that they put the victim in a vehicle and went to regions. Regions has been advised. Copy. Two twenty six. One fifteen. Do we have an okay. update? as to where the red vehicle was. Stand by, I'll confirm. Ninety-eight thirteen transport. Squad ninety-eight thirteen. Well, if you know, come us up to the PD for a test. Fifteen and CC is working on location of that red vehicle now. Copy that. Fifty one eighty two, another status check. Fifty one eighty four, code four. Copy, code four, two twenty eight. Three four six, two squad, they're in there. Bleacher, is that two twenty eight? Thank you. 
What you're sick, it sounds like you have medics en route to our location. There's no victim here. You can cancel them. Copy. Two seven three. Go ahead. Did you have Minnesota plate Echo Hotel Fox Rod 096 in front of 535 Chevron? Squad 115, for the TT, that red vehicle is last seen heading westbound on St. Clair. Alright, copy that, thank you. Just run it. Clear squad, it's GOA. GOA, 2.30. complicated here, but uh, looks like this guy is, in fact, the uh, the victim. His car's got several holes in it on the side, on the side there. there he, says he does have a gun in there that he uses for protection, but it hasn't been fired. So we are going to, uh, we're going to recover the gun. And even though we're pretty sure he did not fire the gun, we're going to take a look at it, have it tested to see if it see if it has been fired. Whoops. I'm getting out if you want to talk. 